adding your screen like this will help you get more views on the youtube videos welcome to my channel guys i'm golden ij and in today's video i'm going to teach you how to add end screen to your youtube videos end screen is that youtube feature that is added between the last 5 to 20 seconds of our youtube videos it serves different purposes we use it to encourage viewers to subscribe to our channel we also use it to direct viewers to other videos in our channel we can use it to promote another channel. Maybe we want to grow a second YouTube channel. We can also use it to link to an external website. End screen can be added when uploading your video or when you are done uploading the video. End screen does not work on videos that are set for made for kids. And your video must be at least 25 seconds for end screen to be able to work on it. So before I begin the tutorial proper, make sure to subscribe to my channel so that YouTube will suggest my video to other people. Thank you. To be able to insert end screen into our YouTube videos, we go to the YouTube studio to do that. Everyone that has channel on YouTube knows what YouTube studio is. But because we are using a smartphone to do this, we'll be using our Chrome extension. Because if I use YouTube Studio Mobile, it's not going to show us the feature to insert an end screen into the video. Therefore, we are using the Chrome extension. The first thing we'll do is to open our Chrome browser. Type YouTube Studio Desktop. YouTube Studio Desktop. Click and hold. I did not say tap once. If you tap once, it will just open. Click and hold and then open. Click on open a new tab. Then go to this place where all the open tabs in your Chrome is shown. Some phones it is up and some phones it is down. Click on it. Then open the newest tab, not the place you are in already, the newest tab. This is your YouTube Studio desktop, the way it will open in your computer. Use your fingers to zoom in. On the left hand side, where all the features and tools of a YouTube Studio desktop app is shown, click on that line there for you to see everything. Then click on content. Select the video you want to insert the end screen into. I'm using this. Then zoom to the right side of the video. You will see end screen, where end screen is written. Click on it. When it has opened like this, there are different templates already where you can choose. You can choose any of them. This place is the preview. Then, but you can customize by clicking on element. Then the first thing I will choose is subscribe button. When I choose subscribe, it will be added to my video. Then I can go there again, click on elements again, and choose video. When I have chosen video, I will click on choose specific video. Then all the videos will be displayed for me to choose from. I can just select any one. And then see, see where it has been placed. Then, if I want to add more videos, I'll click on the element again. I can choose playlist. Then choose the playlist I want to add to the video. When I'm done choosing the video and the playlist that I want to add, I'll make sure to come to this preview, preview section to make sure that none of them is placed on another if it is placed on another like this and once it's red 
once it shows red like this it is not going to work there is a problem so you have to make sure that all of them are well placed and none on top of another you can add up to four videos then the next thing you will do is to come down here and adjust the timing come down adjust the timing where you want the end screen to start when you are done inserting and editing you will click on save but if you notice any mistake or you want to make any changes you can click on undo when you are done inserting and editing the end screen the way you want it to appear then click on save and the end screen is saved to your video thanks for watching guys remember to subscribe to my channel for more of these tutorials